You know, there's a, a term that we use in college football, it's called measurables. And I don't even think it's an actual real word. I mean, my spell check throws it out all the time, but it is real for us college coaches. What we do is we take your height and weight and your vertical and your shuttle and your 40 time and standing broad jump, and if we can get arm length, right? Those are measurables. And what it does for us is it gives us an indication of your ability to play at our level. We're not going to take a 5'10 quarterback, rarely, to play at the highest level. Right? Quarterbacks need to be 6'1", 6'2", 6'3", depending on all the other measurables. Arm strength, feet, quickness, right? How fast do they get into their, uh, you know, into their drop and set and throw? Their timing is a measurable. We use measurables to help us in conjunction with videotape and your transcripts to determine if you're a prospect. And it can eliminate you in a heartbeat if your measurables are not what we're looking for. So when I'm going to a camp or a combine, and combines really are where measurables are taken. Camps are football specific drills. Combines are testing, height, weight, vertical. Those numbers that you get from there better be great or don't go, right? Or don't go. Now, let me tell you this. You go to a combine and you run a, a bad 40 or a shuttle and you will take that number and don't put it in there, the college coach assumes you didn't run very well. So be ready when you go and know how important measurables are to college coaches. Because we can't measure heart, right? But we can see heart and your football play on the field is what we can see on tape. But we need to know you can run and jump and, and explode. Measurables are key.